um good evening guys welcome back to the channel um yeah it's been a long time coming hey so um yeah so this is something that god has recently placed on my heart and it's something that i have been doing myself so um lately um i've been procrastinating my time you know like um when god like calls me like to share like to when he calls, like, you know, there are times where you just get woken up in the middle of the night by God, like, where he just wants, like, where you can just feel his presence, and then, you know, he just wants to minister to you and stuff, and then you still just be like, Lord, I'm tired, then you continue sleeping. So, like, that's been happening to me a lot lately, um, where I don't, like, I make excuses to spend time with God, but, like, nah. I'm going to study and then I'm going to talk to you later, Lord. Like, Lord, not now. Like, I think I've been going through that a lot. And the Lord just gave me this word. So, yeah, I took, I was taking my evening nap before I start studying. And then uh, when I woke up, I woke up with some kind of joy, you know. Um, I didn't put on an alarm. Like, I asked, I asked somebody to call me, like, so I can wake up. And I told them, like, please call me at um, 6.40. Yeah. And then um, I wake up, I look at my time, and I'm like, it's 6.40 on the dot. The person hasn't called me yet, and I haven't set an alarm yet. And I'm like, Lord, this can only be you. This can definitely just be you. And then I'm filled with joy. Like, I wake up, and then I'm filled with joy that I don't know from where. Because usually when I wake up, I'm grumpy, you know. Why am I supposed to wake up now? I can sleep for another 10 minutes and stuff. But then this time I open my eyes. I'm like, Lord, wow. And I'm filled with this joy. And then when I get woken up, and I'm like, no, I'm already awake. And I'm just so joyful. So this is a joy of God. But then not diverging from the topic. Um, I got a word from the Lord that time does not belong to us, guys. Time is not in our hands. We do not control time. Even the 24 hours that we think that we have, that is not even ours. It does not belong to us. Like, time belongs to God. That's what the Lord told me. Like, time belongs to Him. And we need to give it back to Him. Like, we do not have the right to be making excuses that, Lord, no, I don't have um, enough time. I need to study. No, Lord, I'm tired. I need to study. I need to do this. I need to rest. I need to do this. Like, that's what the Lord is telling me. Like, that does not belong to us. Like, time does not belong to us. It belongs to Him, and we need to give it back to Him. Um, The Word says that, we all know the scripture that says that, take first the kingdom of God, and all shall be added unto you, right? Uh, the moment that we start taking time and um how should i say the moment we start dividing god and time then um that's the moment that we actually are not seeking god at all because when god says that you should do everything as unto him it means that we should spend every second in everything that we do we should spend it with him and that's the way that i got from him and i am guilty of that i know that i'm guilty of that and then i just before i close down this video i just wanted us to pray about it um just a little bit prayer about it so i would like us to pray dear heavenly father thank you so much lord that you're god thank you so much lord that you're king thank you so much lord that you endure forever your love endures forever lord i pray that as exams are approaching as some of us are writing exams as tests are approaching as we are finishing off with the year that you be god and then you be king over our lives lord but i pray that we start our day with you and then we spend our day with you and then we end our day with you may we not exclude you in any aspect of our days oh lord jesus but i pray for everyone who is guilty of this including myself lord jesus we pray that you may please forgive us lord for we did not know what we were doing, Lord Jesus. Lord, I pray that you remove the snare of the enemies from our life, Lord Jesus. Lord, I pray that through all this chaos, may we, ask, may we seek to hear your voice, Lord Jesus. May we seek to know that you are the King of all kings. May we seek to know that you and everything else on this earth, you are the author of it and 
it all belongs to you lord jesus may we spend our time accordingly knowing that we are not here for ever lord but then we are here as a way passing by to the second life lord we pray that you will guide us that you'll give us the strength to share the gospel with one another lord lord and i pray that you'll guide us that you'll protect us lord as we seek you more lord jesus everything shall be added up to us lord we we'll pray for academic excellence lord jesus i pray for um glory like sh like, Lord, I pray for a shine, Lord Jesus, that will bring glory to your name, Lord Jesus. I pray that everything that we'll be doing from now on shall be done with you and it shall be done in your name. Thank you so much, Lord, for being God. Thank you so much, Lord, that you are king. Thank you so much, Lord, that you are forever taking care of us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. And see you all in the next video good luck with your exams and remember to do it all as if you are doing it unto god that's how you spend time with god bye guys